Hey, welcome to Vic Sports Center. I'm Vic Battalero. And I'm Tom Battalero. And hey, we're happy to have you today. We kind of want to give you a little walkthrough of our shop. It's something my brother and I started about 21 years ago. It's grown a lot over the years. This was the first part of the shop. We started a little bit with archery and guns. As you can see, we still have some deer heads and fish in here. Absolutely. We used to have a 20 yard archery range upstairs that man we did a lot of bow shooting and a lot of gun selling and all that kind of stuff and now we just completely focus on boats. And I'll tell you what we have a lot of fun doing it. We enjoy going out fishing and selling boats and fixing them. We enjoy everything about it and unloading all those new boats. It's like Christmas every day isn't it? Absolutely. We have got to do a bunch of them. We are going to take a tour of the showroom in a little bit here but right now we wanted to show the front shop and basically what we have is on on the right wall when you walk in we have all kinds of props fish finders trolling motor parts gas tanks all kinds of accessories like that and we do stock a lot of hummingbird and Lowrance electronics we have dual pro battery chargers guest battery chargers you name it we do stock a lot of parts okay uh, and then we also do a lot of installing of those parts. So we do stock a lot of fish finders, battery chargers, all that stuff, and we install them in your boat for you. That's right. Anything that you see, any part that you might want for your boat, any questions you might have about putting those things on the boats, that's what we do every day and we enjoy talking to you about it, where you're going to want it, and how you're going to install it, and we do do that in our service department. Absolutely. And that is a great thing that we do here is we solely focus on fishing boats. A lot of marinas you'll go to and you'll see pontoons and pleasure boats and all that kind of stuff. We solely focus on walleye fishing boats, bass fishing boats, some family fun fishing boats, but everything is definitely fishing oriented. Maybe even some bluegill boats too. Maybe even a couple bluegill. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Well hopefully you enjoy the trip through the showroom. We're going to show you some boats here in a minute. Hey, before we head back to that showroom, I wanted to introduce everybody to Andy. And Andy is our parts and warranty and service guy. And a lot of times when you call in, if you're calling in looking for a boat, a lot of times me and Victor take that phone call, but a lot of the times Andy takes that call and he takes care of everything you need here at Big Sports Center. Happy to help you with any of your parts or service. Thank you. Absolutely. Hey, welcome to our showroom. What do you think of this? Big Boy Toy Store. What do you think? It is very laid out. Right now, for, we have all of our 2014 models in stock. And this is probably the most full our showroom has ever been right now. No doubt. I'll tell you what, Ranger Boats and StarCraft Boats have done a great job getting our 2014 boats here early. Usually we're struggling to get them by the January boat show. Here we are in November and this showroom is full. We've got 35 boats on display. On display right now, and the greatest thing about it is, is we have everything from our 17 foot and 16 foot Starcrafts all the way up to our 621 Rangers fully rigged, all set up and ready to go, all sitting in a showroom. So this is the time of the year that when it's the snow starts flying outside, you can come on into the showroom, we're open all year round, and you can just come sit in boats and man do we have a selection. Without a doubt, and my favorite boat's in the back corner back there, the new 521C, probably my favorite boat that <laughs> Rangers ever built, and I just can't wait to go out and drive it this year at Okeechobee, Florida. Absolutely, and we, and we do have our full line of Starcrafts back in this corner of the boat, at the corner of the showroom, and we are actually still walleye fishing this time of the year, that night bite's starting to fire up, and so anybody that wants to come over and take a look at the boats that we use for that night bite, we do have, like I said, the 621 Rangers, the 2050 Ranger Riata, the 196 Fishmaster, the 2100 Fishmaster, the 20 Starwell, the 20 Starwell Big Water. We have them all in stock inside in a heated showroom for you to come look at. And the nice thing about shopping this time of year before the boat shows, we can still give you the boat show specials, but this is also a time of year that if the weather's a little bit nicer this fall, we can still get you out to West Branch, let you take a little test drive and actually feel what the boats are like before you get the boat for next year. Absolutely. Well, I'll tell you what, we're going to let Eric hop down out of that boat. We're going to take a little walk around the showroom. Sounds good. Okay, here we are at the bass boats, and as you can see, we have a large selection of bass boats in stock, starting with our 178 Ranger. This is a new Ranger they came out with this last year. Very popular in this area, you know, nice 17 and a half foot boat. 
What's this boat price out at? You know, these started around the 18,000 mark. We have this one set up with a 60 e tech But the great thing about these particular boats, they are a very well laid out bass boat. But the great thing with Ranger is you can go right online and actually price your own bass boat with these. So you can pick out what trolling motor you want, what fish finder you want, what motor you want, which if you want any trailer options, anything you want right online, hit a button, it'll give you a final price and you can just look them up right online to get a total price on these at rangerboats.com. And very value oriented boats, so great value for what you're getting and a very fishable boat. Absolutely, and Ranger has done a great job with these. They started out last year. Um, we sold a bunch of them, which was wonderful, but it's really given the, our customers the opportunity to buy a lower dollar boat, still with the Ranger name, with the Ranger seats, the Ranger consoles, the Ranger trail trailer, all the fit and finish you expect out of a Ranger at a very affordable price. No doubt. And hey, moving down the line, we've got our 17-foot model. And this has been a great model that Ranger came up with, basically started last year in this exact layout. Uh, the nicest thing is this is the first generation where you can get into a center load rod locker, which I think is very important. Gives the, the deck a lot of space, a lot of storage under the deck uh, to store your tackle, to store your rods, and to have a great flipping deck. Absolutely. And these 17 footers have been real popular for Ranger for a long time where they started out with the R70 series way back in the early 90s when we first started in business. And uh, it's been a great seller for us and for, for Ranger Period just to be able to get people into a bass boat um, at a reasonable price. Uh, these start out at around the 28 mark with the 115 Pro XS Mercury on it. And again, it all really depends on what kind of options you start throwing on from there. But a very economical boat. Um, fits in all the garages, great for, for the Portage Lakes, for all the smaller inland lakes. Um, just a great all-around boat, like Victor said, with a big center rod locker and lots of storage, and that Ranger fit and finish, it just all comes together. No doubt. And hey, moving down the line, probably our number one selling boat, the Z118. Now they've laid it out a little bit different this year. This is the new Z118C, so they've incorporated the nice lights into the gunnels like that. Uh, the recessed pedals kind of standard, but you do get your center rod locker and the new consoles that accommodate the big fish finders, which I think is very important. Absolutely. And the new C models, which they came out with the C models last year, and now they are running them all the way through their line. But the Z118C has some new bells and whistles on it from the center glove box option to tool extra tool holders everywhere. Your bunk board is out of the rod locker so you don't have to open a compartment to actually measure a fish. Just lots of little things like Victor said, the new Z consoles that can accommodate big fish finders and also give you a lot of leg room. That's one of the greatest things about these new Z consoles. Yeah, they look wonderful, but they're very, very great. They're very good for the customer that is six foot four, six foot five. That now he can actually get underneath that console and sit comfortably. That's right. And these boats start in that middle 30s range, so they're still a great affordable boat. The way the banks are financing these days, if you've got good credit, they're in that five percent range, which gets the payments really down and dirty on this boat. Absolutely, it's it's a great overall value, and it really just depends pricing wise on how you lay it out. We usually get most of our boats in pretty decked out. So like this particular one has front and console and front GPS fish finder, both down imaging, 84 Trex trolling motors. And you know what else they did on the Z118s this year, which is a really great feature, because I know you always hog the front of the boat, is it has padding underneath the carpet on the front deck on the very front of the front deck, which is a very nice feature. That's why me and Victor most of the time fight who gets to fish on the front deck, because it is like standing in your living room all day when you're on that phone. It makes a difference. I'll tell you that people don't really realize what a Ranger boat is to fish out of it. I know this boat has the padded carpet, but the stability of the Ranger, how solid they sit on the water when another boat drives by and the boat doesn't rock a lot, just everything about this particular boat, they make it just an enjoyable fishing day out there. Absolutely, that's what it's all about. You got it. Well, let's move on down to some of my favorite boats. Getting down to the 520C. Now, this is uh, taking a little bit of a jump because our Z119 we've already sold and delivered, I guess. <laughs> and our second one's sitting over there getting rigged now. So. You ain't kidding. So that's a very popular model. We'll talk a little bit about that later. But this is the uh, flagship in the Ranger line, the 520. Comanche Sea, um, just a super boat. I can't say enough about it. I fished all last season out of it. It was a great fishing boat, loads of storage. You can see how wide they've made the deck. Again, the center load rod lockers, 
loads of options, big fish finders in the dash and the bow. So, I mean, they're just a great all round fishing boat. Absolutely. And, you know, we used to, uh, for the most part, sell mostly 21 foot bass boats here. We sold a lot of Z21s. When the 520 came out and the 520C, and they made the boat as wide as they have now, we have been still selling just as many 20 foot boats, which is really great to have both of them in your lineup. Um, the, the amount of deck space on this boat is just absolutely incredible. Um, the, the storage is awesome, and it also gives you a little extra speed that uh, most people never got to see in a Ranger. These boats empty before you load them up with all your gear are, are running mid to high 70s on your GPS, which is absolutely amazing for a Ranger because they are a very heavy boat. But the engineers down there did a really, really great job, and they're getting some really good speed out of these boats, but yet you still get the Ranger ride and the Ranger stability. So the 520C is still just, a, just an awesome package. Um, with the Z consoles, with, with just everything that they have, they're, they're just an unbelievable boat. Without a doubt. And we sold a lot of them last year. Um, now, moving on to the 521, now you've got the same model, just a little bit stretched out. And this is their big boy as far as their lineup. Um, this is the boat that I actually got to order this year, one just like this, and I can't wait to get it. Um, a little bit stretched out, so you get a little bit more deck space in the front. Nice wide deck, narrower gunnels, so you don't have useless space, basically. Um, and just a, a great fishing layout. You know what it is, and I got to actually drive this boat. It was absolutely amazing how solid this boat was in the water. We, we did just get to take it to West Branch, but I took a couple customers out. They both ended up ordering a 521C, but they were just amazed, and I was amazed and how there was just nothing on West Branch that I could do with this boat that I could get it to move and come out of the water. We were, it was a really, really windy day. It was actually uh, late this fall, and uh, there were foot and a half waves down there at the dam at West Branch, and it drove through them like they weren't even there. And, and uh, I actually got out of the driver's seat and let the customers drive, and they were doing power turns in the waves. Um, we stayed dry. The boat never left the water. It was just incredibly solid. You could actually feel a little bit of extra length how the boat rode. It really did actually ride better than a 520, which it should be expected to. You could tell that I don't believe it's going to be as fast as the 520 when we did get to hit the throttle a little bit towards the end when we were getting the motor broke in. I noticed it didn't have as much lift coming out of the water as the 520, but I got to tell you, uh, most of our customers are super happy with running 70 miles an hour with your tournament gear in it. And uh, 70 miles an hour for a big boat like this is just awesome. And to be able to run across waves doing that, it's, it's even better. So just an incredible, incredible package. I can't wait to get out there and fish up. Okay, we went all over all those Ranger bass boats that are all sitting over there in a line. And now we've popped across the, the showroom and we have our Ranger Riata series that we've started out with in our lineup over here. And these are our bigger deep V boats, our Rangers. This, is a, this particular boat is more of a Ranger family fun boat, the fish and ski. But I can tell you, I used one on Lake Erie last year to go troll for some walleyes. It was absolutely awesome. But then we also took one on vacation and had a great time down in Tennessee with it. So a very, very versatile boat right there. Right, and one of our number one sellers in this area, because people with families that still want to go fishing, it gives you everything you'd want to do, whether you're cruising the Portage Lakes, uh, going out to dinner, bluegill fishing with the kids, or going up on Lake Erie doing some skiing, whatever you want to do, these are the perfect boats for that. They make them in an 18 and a half foot model and a 20 and a half foot model, uh, just depending where you want to be. Absolutely. And then we pop over to the 1880 Angler, which is a little bit more fishing oriented. It doesn't quite have all the family fun features to it, but definitely could be a great family boat. Seating for, for four behind the consoles, full windshield, um, but yet a great almost bass boat front deck. Um, with a big center rod locker, trolling motor up front, battery chargers, all of it go comes in those boats, and just a, just a great all-around boat. Um, if you want to go up to Lake Erie and do some fishing, but also, like you said, go to Portage Lakes and do some bass fishing, just a great rig. You ain't kidding. And you know, we can't forget, you know, we've sold a lot of these Rangers, but along the lines, we've also sold lots and lots of Starcrafts. And here's one of our great Starcrafts. This is the Star Weld, which is the welded version of the old Starcraft boat, similar to our old Monarchs that we really started our business with. Nice deep haul, you can see the big V's. This is an aluminum boat that's painted and finished very well. Um, it's an all-round boat. It's got your cushions up in the boat. 
Uh, so if you want to take the family out skiing and fishing, um, at the same time, basically going out on Lake Erie, doing whatever you'd like to do. Absolutely, and it was great last year. We actually started installing ski pylons in these star wells, and we actually we sold a lot of ski pylons last year on the back of these boats, which was absolutely wonderful. People that uh, want to take the kids, like you said, tube and ski and doing all that, they can do it. But even when you decide you're going to go out to Lake Erie and go do some walleye fishing, they would hold on to that. A lot of people said when they stood on that rear deck to net that fish, it was great to have that ski pile on there to hold on to when they're netting their fish. So they said it absolutely was not in the way at all. It actually was a, a, a helpful for netting fish. That's right. And a lot of people like these aluminum boats. Uh, the aluminum boats have a little bit of an advantage as far as being a little bit lighter than the fiberglass boats. And as far as going up near rocks and things like that, a lot of guys like taking these up to Canada and doing a lot of good fishing. So. Absolutely. And the, the aluminum boats definitely tend to have deeper interiors to them, where our star welds have 30-inch interiors, which is wonderful. Um, you feel very safe up there in the lake. And we have a couple different uh, styles. That, the first particular boat we were looking at is more of the family fun boat with a flip-up bench seat in the back, the open bow with the bow cushions. This particular boat is the Big Water Star Weld, the 20 Big Water, where it has a sealed off back end. So you can actually walk all the way to the back of the boat. Awesome boat for when you're perch fishing, walleye fishing. Mostly set up to be more of a straight fishing boat. So this is definitely, uh, don't get me wrong, you could go pull a tube on it or get some skis on it and have the family out. But mostly set up to be that Lake Erie machine. That's right. And Lake Erie do a lot of that trolling. And that's where this style boat and the next boat, the really the 196 Fishmaster, this is where it all started for StarCraft is the big water trolling boat. Very deep inside, nice wide beam. This boat's eight and a half foot wide. You can see the depth. And like Tommy said, you get a great feel in the boat. It's deep. You're down in the boat. If you have kids, we take the kids out fishing, trolling on Lake Erie, you feel safe because they're in their own little plate then down in the boat. Absolutely. And, and that's the big thing is the interior of our Starcrafts and Star Welds. Again, having that depth. A lot of our customers will climb up in these boats, they'll get up in there, and as soon as they walk up along the side of the boat, and they'll feel that the cushions are hitting them high in the thighs, they think this is great because it doesn't, you know, the side of the boat is not hitting them in the knee. And that's actually what we have to have in here in the showroom. We have to actually have stairs to get up into these boats because I can tell you they are a very deep boat. Not exactly easy to get into when you're when you're not in the water, but man, when they get in the water, they handle, perform amazingly. A very dry ride, very solid ride, and like Victor said, the great interior for the big water. Without a doubt. And then moving down the line even a little bit further, StarCraft also makes the 21-footer. So it's just the big brother to the 196, a little bit stretched out, a little bit more horsepower, tandem trailer, great Lake Erie rig. Absolutely, lots and lots of room. And then our flagship on the walleye side, another big monster walleye boat is our Ranger 621. And this is an amazing machine, 21 foot, full windshield on this particular one. You can get them with bubble windshields or you can get them with the full windshields. But just an all around amazing walleye boat that you can still take and do some bass fishing. There's a lot of guys on Lake Erie that use the 6 Series walleye boats to bass fish up on Lake Erie just because of the rough water. That's right. And it is a great boat by Ranger. All these boats by Ranger and StarCraft, we've had great luck with them. We stand behind them. We service them. We've got the service building next door. Hopefully you guys will come out and join us in our showroom and enjoy some of these boats. Absolutely. It'd be great to have you out here just to go through them. And what a better way to choose a boat than to come into a showroom that has 35 boats sitting in it. Right well, you don't now. have to shovel the snow off anymore. We don't have to do anything with it anymore. That's a pretty good deal. Great. <laughs> come out and see us. Hey, thanks everyone for watching the tour. Hopefully you enjoyed it and you got to see a little bit of what we're about anyway. One thing we wanted to mention, as you notice, we do sell all three brands of motors. We sell Mercury, Yamaha, and Evinrude, and we service all three. Absolutely. So uh, anything you might need here at VIX, we're happy to help you. Yeah, and you can get a hold of us by giving us a call at 330-673-7600 or looking us up on the web at VIXSportsCenter.com. Our address is 2039 Talmadge Road. It's actually Kent, Ohio, 44240. Thanks for watching.